Okay, just just for the record of the stream, I just updated it to enter the gungeon. So if it's wrong, it's it's Twitch's fault. Oh. Actually, let me go back because we did have a donation message from Mr. William for $25. We are William? I don't know. It's A. William. Uh, let me see if I remember how to get to okay, well, streamlines. Wish I could come today. See you tomorrow. Also, that $50 donation did come with a message. Have fun, play hard, and raise money for children's hospitals. Thank you, Anonymous. And you know what? Fine. I'll, I'll, I'm going to make a $7 donation for the seven stars that Lily miraculously, that the game just handed to Lily. Uh, let's go ahead and go back to the stream. Again, exclamation point, extra life in the chat to get our donation link and donate money to help save kids. Are you playing Gungeon now? I'm playing into the Gungeon. So what happened to Overwatch? Uh, we're just switching them because since the Switch is connected to the Elgato anyway, it makes more sense to do it this way. <laughs> You're switching them. <laughs> I'm switching them. Actually, Enter <laughs> um, the Gungeon was originally right after the, um, the uh, whatever segment this is. But or it was originally right after Mario Party, but because Lily was going to leave early, I gave it to Overwatch right after Mario Party. Is she leaving? No, she was, but because she didn't want to stay out too late. But now that she doesn't have to because uh, she has her friend walk with her, it's not as much of a problem. So I'm gonna move the mic up and then lower the volume substantially. Enter the dungeon? Yeah. And you have a sense of Go ahead. And I'm going to donate seven dollars for the for each of these stars that the game handed to Lily. Wow, that is extremely loud. Wow, I was like, the red flag is coming. The judgment is upon us. <laughs> okay, wait. Let me let me sit down. Let me get this donation and extra life in first. And then okay. Wait, so once Lily leaves, what are we doing? She is staying. Oh, she's staying. Oh. She was she was originally going to stay, in fact, but uh, since Adam's not here, we had to do a little bit, bit of rescheduling. But thankfully, Angela is here to walk with her. So then, while we're packing up, she can stay for the board game segment at the end because we need people for that. One. Is anyone else gonna show up? Uh, no, it's just us four. William will be coming to for tomorrow for the third day of streaming. Apparently, it doesn't remember my PayPal login. That's that's interesting. All right, let's set the volume way down. So, uh, James wants me to tell Anita about the actual live stream, right? Yes, she does. So just, and just link her, link her the donation stuff. Yes, T link her the stream, link her the donation link. That is what he said. 834, oh, I shouldn't say that loud. Well, it's not like, it's not like uh, anyone could be on the login screen besides me, I guess. All right. 
Let's jump into it. Now, it seems like it started me on a run, which I'm not going to. I'm not going to honor currently, because I don't know when I started that one. But it's not a huge deal. So, Enter the Gungeon, if you're unfamiliar, is one of the most recent uh, releases as a roguelike, published by Devolver Digital. It has specific theming. It's the theming, if you haven't noticed, is guns. And lots of them. Uh, yeah. If you you can turn up half of the lights. Yeah. Can you turn up the ones in the front? Wait, hold on. It's not just in the front. Why oh, is this classroom so big? How's that? That's too dark. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. Can you turn up one of them? Yeah, this one of them. You see the this half or this half? This half or this half? Hey, what? Can you stop you doing can... that? <laughs> Jesus. Okay, open up this one. This light. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. These, I can barely see the uh, screen. <laughs> what? Do you, do you think he got it? <laughs> there it is, $7, one per star. You're welcome. All right, here we go. Let's see, let's see how many floors I'm actually able to get through here for the Gungeon. I wouldn't be... I'm sorry, I'm trying to test something out. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Oh, maybe we could have played Cuphead. No, we played Cuphead last year. Cuphead? <laughs> yeah. I did not see that. Uh, it's actually a really well-made game. Yep. Uh, so what I'm looking for here on the first floor, I don't believe I would want to go to the Oubliette here on the first floor. Not to begin, it's been a while since I've actually played Gungeon, so I'm a little bit rusty in my dodges, in case you haven't noticed. I really lost the armor. Not a huge steal though, you just don't wanna... It's the, it's the bosses you don't wanna get hit on. Very, very two theme. That's a break. Eh? That was a blank. Still running the buttons. Or still reloading the buttons. Right, so A is blank. Uh, and B was my flip table button. Yeah. Gotta get more casings. Up at 20. Oh, they have two keys though, so that's good. We're not playing as the pilot, so I don't have the lockpick. That is a brown chest. Brown chest is the worst chest to get, so I'm not going to pop that one open. That one will most likely just get shot. Wow. Real, real spot on with the dodging today. Two grenades. Good to know. We did get a we did get a full heart though. I'm just gonna have to take that one. Unfortunate. Uh, heart overkill, but you know, gotta be a full health. I guess you're wondering. I did lose the helmet because I don't have my armor piece anymore. But if we get the armor piece, we get the helmet back. And that, you know, that's that's the important part. Really. All right. Uh, dead end. But it looks like we did find the fireplace room again. I don't think I'm gonna go to the Ubli yet, just because it is more of a challenge floor for the. Uh, to get to the sacred crown, not sacred crown, the sacred bullet, uh, the throne of bullets, to get to the true bullet king. So we're not gonna go that way. It's good if you're a little bit behind to just kind of if you can avoid taking the damage, just because of the advantages you get from the extra items and all and the chests on that floor. But it's it's a challenging floor, so. I will also be avoiding getting a jammed run just because I don't. I'm not a fan of uh, making this harder, especially. Again, I'm a little rusty. That was a rubber bullet. I'm glad that was a rubber bullet because I did not see it charging me. Where's the hollow? So 
So right now I'm just exploring the floor. I'm looking for my second chest before I actually go into the uh, the boss room. Oh, he wasn't tall. I got hit twice there. It feels bad. All right, looking at the next one here. Ooh, ooh, Lilliken. Still more, a couple of shotgun just cans here. Would like to find the chest a little bit soon, as well as the shop. I don't really think I'm going to be picking anything up yet. Not the key. I'm still going to shoot over the brown one, though. It's not worth using one of my keys on it. Despite how far behind I am. Never worth it. If we're lucky, we get the mini game. We don't. Green chest is good enough, though. Not a mimic. Extended mag, I'll take it. We didn't find... I don't think we found the shop yet, actually. So there should be one more path. Oh, never mind. We did find the shop. I just didn't go to it. Good to know. 53 casings, though. We got a lot to spend. Should be able to pick up a gun. We do have the membrane. And Gungeon map is worthless. Oh, it's the plague pistol. Okay, that's substantially worse. Although I think it's... It's not worth it. I think I think I will just go with default pistol. You know, when I say that out loud, it makes me want to pick up the play pistol. I don't like going in the bosses with like such a weak weapon, but hopefully we just get uh, shades and nope, we're getting the Gatling call. Yeah, the damage over time for the poison will definitely speed this up. We do have a blank. I'll try to remember to use it, but no promises. I also have an ammo drop still. I haven't used my uh, active. And he's about to shoot. I really like playing as a marine just because the extra accuracy bonus that he gets really helps with weapons with uh, larger than normal sprays. Or spread, not spray. don't know where he landed. I, I still do not know where he landed. Just firing in his general direction. There is. I'm trying to save the blank, because I think I am just going to use it. I was going to save it for a secret room, but we killed him without taking a hit, so we do get the health upgrade. Which is helpful. Though one of them is a mimic. Which isn't good because I really don't again the flick pistol isn't the best pistol for this, so okay. I'm not in danger of dying, but uh I really don't want to have to deal with a mimic. Okay, oh well, we got him. We get the frost giant, that's gonna be our new boss killer. Oop, I dropped it. New boss killer for sure, ammo drop, free armor, we've got the helmet back, and we get the master chamber for the floor. No more blanks, which means we aren't able to find the secret room. You need a blank to find it. Well, you can actually just shoot the wall to find it, but we- oh. I don't know. Oh, there's a shop! Mutation's pretty solid, but we, do we don't have enough casings. I don't believe I had any hearts yet. I don't have any more hearts on the floor. I know more casing. I know more rooms to explore to pick up any more casings. Oh, I do have this to shoot, actually. Completely forgot to shoot this. Did you get that full ammo? Alright. I'll just go ahead and pop through here. Second floor, first floor down. Not bad. We did get the health upgrade from the boss, so that's more important. That's, uh... Definitely what you want, obviously. So that's what we're going for. Try and get this a little closer. There we go. Alright. So, second floor. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the... I think this is like the caves floor. Kind of like similar to Splunky's first floor. We have the mine shafts. Oh, no, that's the, that's, the, that's the third floor. Never mind. So that's the third floor. Here we go. The Gungeon proper... This is where the game really begins. The tutorial area is over, and then we really have to play with our um, with our hops, with our dodge rolls. I would like to point out your dodge roll can be used as both a mobility tool and a uh, avoiding bullets tool. I will be using the plague pistol to clear rooms just because uh, you always want to be using your second best gun to clear 
room, so I'm just gonna blank. I don't want to take damage. Um, it's actually a lot more useful uh, for you to be using a good gun. What? What is my fast swap? Oh, it's why. Why is my fast swap? Just because I want to have the main pistol for, for. Okay, that's not the fast swap. What button is bring up the menu button? I have to check the controls because I don't remember. What button brings up the next gun, next item, gun? Oh, it's X. X is the gun menu. There it is. So I want this and my plague pistol on hot swap. There we go. Uh, but yeah, it's usually always better to keep your... You have a room cleaning weapon and boss killing weapons. Ideally, you have two of each with a... Well, more than one of each just because you want to make sure you keep your ammo on high. Those are poison puddles. Stand them for too long, you will take poison damage. I'm gonna switch over to marine pistol here just because these guys don't really pose much of a threat at all. And there aren't any room hazards. Well, there are room hazards, but there aren't any pressing room hazards that I want to leave the room as soon as possible for. We do have the gun game. I will go ahead and play. And then I will, I will say I'm very bad at these. So the red ones just instantly kill my guy here, so I just kind of want to get this lined up. One down. Uh, this shot's tricky. So these green ones will disappear if I hit them. Can I get a shot through? I don't think I can. Uh, let's see. Any more easy... Re oh, I might be able to get a rebound. The guy in the back corner. Let's see. Oh, I saw it for a second. Okay. Now I just got to time this. Nailed him. Okay. Two more. The better you do in this minigame, the better chest you get. Oh, that's going to nail him. Okay, cool. So I just want to angle this. Oh. There we go. Okay. Uh, I'm going to wait for him to go one more round here and wait for the blue block to not be in the way. Well, I, I failed both of those, so I'm just going to go for the easy shot. Alright, three in a row. Pretty good. Green chest as well. I'm just going to double check that this is not... Well, I keep doing that. Sorry. I'm just going to quickly double check that this is not a mimic. It is not... Shotgun! What, Kevin? Okay. Well, we got the shotgun shell. This shotgun shell shoots shotguns which shoot shotgun bullets. This is now our room player because it's a shotgun that shoots shotguns. Another blank, always helpful. Good for bosses. Especially against the high dragon. There's a chance you in the room, I think? Oh, I lost the armor. Yeah, it's a chance you Okay. I'm just gonna take out the sniper kin. Alright, shop. Only six casings, can't really spend much. And we didn't pick up any hearts. We do have the uh, nod key, but I'm not going to go for the rat. It's not yet. Okay, I, I, I like to have like kicked that down. Thank you. Away from where I'm going to be situating myself. And the bullet king just killed himself, so... You know. No complaints. Nailed him. Uh, there was there was a bloodletting. Uh, there was the vampire dude. So if I wanted to, if I have the extra hearts, I could. Wait a minute. Oh no, this is this is the get to the staircase to the yeah chamber of the true gun. Uh, so I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna explore the rest of the floor here. Take hopefully find the next chest relatively soon. Got ourselves the extra key. There's a gun buffer in the middle. Get rid of him. He's still alive down there. Got him. This was definitely going better than the first one, I will, have, I will say. 
but uh, things I would like to get. Well, definitely prefer perfecting the next boss. I think the Frost Giant's gonna help with clearing the next boss. Whoever it is, a lot easier. I'm um, hopefully, hopefully it's gonna do so. I do not want to face the Amoconda. Amoconda by far is the hardest boss for the second floor. Okay, and that just loops at the beginning, so we're just gonna warp up here. Okay. Kill the Chancellor as fast as possible. Despite this guy buffing. Running a little bit low on ammo, but I don't think I'm going to be using my, uh... I keep doing that. I'm gonna be using my, uh... Not a mimic. I keep <laughs> using my ammo drop on him. Uh, one more pathway. Uh, two more pathways we can check. Again, still looking for the second chest. The blue one is the second rarest. The green one is one after it. It does not... Oh, I didn't dodge roll. It does not follow the standard uh, pattern. There it is. Still more on this one. Okay, I was gonna say there wasn't anything too pressing in this room, but now that there is, shotgun comes out. Yeah, it's a dodge roll. Okay, well, the douser sucks, but I guess it's nice to have. I don't know if you caught what I was saying, Kevin, but this is a shotgun shell that shoots shotguns that shoot bullets. Ooh, synergy chest. And we got it. This is the hegemony rifle, and it synergizes with... The drum bag. And we found the secret room. With a blue chest. And I want to make sure that this is not a mimic. Rations? Solid, solid, I think. I don't... I don't want to look up items. I think this just gives us health back. We're missing some health. I think it's also a health upgrade, so I'm just going to pop it. It just gives us health back, so whatever. <laughs> Could have saved it. Oh, well. Uh, let's see here. Plague Pistol, Frost Giant. Actually, I think we're going to go to the boss next, unless I missed. I missed, didn't miss one path. Oh, sorry, Kevin. Should be one extra room for us to explore here. Grab a armor, hopefully. Maybe another blank. I did use one to open the secret room. Nope. Could use a key, but we used the last one. We should, kind of, we should have, uh, should have enough to buy a key if we so choose. And we do have the blood leather. All right. Prepping my quick switch here. I think it might be frost giant and Gemini rifle. We'll see which one that ends up doing more damage to the Amaconda. No, it's the door lord. I'm gonna let this cutscene play because it's pretty funny. All right. Well, okay. Just gonna blank that pattern. Not not gonna deal with that one. Let's try and get out of range here. Frost Giant. A little bit long to reload. Gets that frozen damage in there. Frozen enemies do take more damage in general. And he's got the laser beam. I I did not perfect this boss, unfortunately. Okay. So no extra health upgrade here. But again, at this point now, we're just trying to mitigate the guys' amount of damage we're taking. Which I'm doing a terrible job of doing. I'm just going to pull out the hegemony rifle. Uh, it seems like the range seems to be doing out pretty well for us here. Good roll. Solar roll. Yeah, the range is working out for us. Although, I guess they both have range. Alright. Now, let's try and avoid these lasers this time. I've only been hitting twice, but again, three times. Jinxed it. But... It's enough. And again, as long as we... <laughs> okay. Well, we're definitely not using the blood leather. I do not have the health anymore. We did get two hearts, though. That is the knife shield as well. So I will actually go ahead and use this and pick this up instead. It's cursed. I forgot it's cursed, but we're going to use it anyway. Uh, we're probably going to be using the, the rest of the shell ammo here. I'm going to use the Gemini rifle for playing rooms. Might as well grab my key. Keys are very useful. And they only get more expensive the further down we go. Uh, did we have any extra hearts? I don't. Yeah, we didn't. Already found the secret room, so that's good. We will get knife shield, which is important for defense. And it is a good defensive tool against bosses. It does a lot of burst damage. Will be helpful. Third chamber, all aboard. Huh? What? Oh. 
Third chamber, not the gun chamber proper. I believe this one should be the mines? Question mark, question mark. Fourth chamber is like the frozen libraries thing, and then the fifth chamber is the actual final gun. Black powder mine, all aboard. This one is usually where a lot of runs tend to end if you don't have the proper late game scaling or the late, uh, late game items that you're looking for. Just a solid weapon also. We have gotten that. Honestly, the Gemini rifle from the synergy chest was really good. It was a solid pickup for us using the pop and knife shield. Did get a key drop as well. That's lucky. I thought that was a explosive barrel. It ended up being water. Nothing to worry about. And this is now out of ammo. Uh, a Gemini rifle and plague pistol now on the room cart. Actually, we'll, we'll use we'll use plague pistol for room cart. Uh, nah, rifle for room cart. More consistent damage, and it does help mitigate one of the more annoying enemies on this floor as well. So, I am all for it. Almost walked into that, not going to lie. Tends to be a problem with dodging. Uh, we do have the mustache. The mustache is actually a really good item if you're lacking coolness, and we do want more coolness. Increases uh, casings uh, dropped, as well as uh, improves item and chest rarity. All right, well, Knife Shield just came back from that. I'm just going to send that out. I completely was mitigated by that uh, detonator. Not going to worry about that. I appreciate that all the casings are auto-collected. So here's the enemy I was talking about. Just keep at range, not even worry about him. Okay, well, Dig Dug over there went to the ground, so we're just gonna focus on this mushroom man. I mean, we're in a good position. It's really just going to depend on how uh, how comfortable I am with avoiding the, uh, the bullets of the bosses we're gonna pick up. Also getting a lot of casings drop, I like seeing that. That's gonna definitely, because I will definitely be wanting to pick up uh, the mushroom. All right. Boss found very quickly. Appreciate that. All right. Chancellons are also really annoying just because of, uh, just because of the fact that they're chancellons and you don't know what they're gonna be. Throwing at you in terms of an attack. Taking down the dig dugs and the uh, bulletkins here. Not gonna worry too much about the uh, poison Yolan chasing us. Fun fact you can just roll on them to kill them. Works out. Nine bullets left in this. That's disappointing. There's one more shot. Uh, so we're running low on ammo now. I don't think I will really need to be buying a ammo crate just yet. Uh, in terms of backup weapons, we actually don't have any, so maybe I won't be uh, purchasing one. I actually like the Thompson as a weapon, but it isn't very useful uh, in the later floors as a room player. Or for anything, really. The damage just doesn't scale well enough. Very lucky on that dodge roll, I'm not gonna lie. Let's switch to the main pistol to try and conserve some of our ammo here now that we're running low. Save the plague pistol for enemies with a little bit more oomph to them. Again, just don't want to stand in the poison too long, otherwise we'll take tick damage. That's that room done. Not in the best situation right now. Our health is looking solid. Obviously we're at full health, but we could have armor and we could definitely be using the ammo. Almost walked off there. Need to kill this man fast. Okay. Oh, please. I just had to blank there. Uh, I was, otherwise, I was going to get hit. I'd rather blank than get hit. Another room. Uh, just annoying enemies. Still going to stick with the marine pistol here. I can deal with them. If I feel like I'm in a little bit of a panic, I will switch over to the play pistol. But right now, we're going to... Solid spot. Maybe I should hold on to my knife shield instead of just throwing it out there, but I feel like 
I feel like it might be more useful to me as damage at this point, just gonna save that for later. Pop that in the heart vending machine. We do have a ghostly uh, amulet here, so we could get an amulet. Owl is obviously just, you can tell by the price, it is a top tier item. We don't have enough for it, unfortunately. I could get the amulet just because it will give us an extra plank on the start of each floor. Lodestone amulet is solid, for the price at least. But uh, still gonna go for that moustache. That was a pit. Forgot about that one. Green chest, whoops, green chest is not a mimic. We'll pop this one open. I don't know what this item is. White guanstone, kindles blanks. All right, so I'm assuming that increases our chance to get uh, blanks dropped. Uh, just checking for the secret room by shooting these walls and we didn't find it. Okay. We do have the boss chamber. Uh, we do have the frost giant as well for the uh, boss killer, but I don't know how much ammo that one has. We don't have any junk, but uh, the next chest I... Okay, that's a, that's a jammed enemy. Uh, the next chest I find will most likely be shot as a result because we do have the shrine to junk knight. So Junker 10, I think his actual name is. That's these guys now. Yeah, jammed enemies have three times as many health as a normal enemy. There he goes. Finally, oh, no, that was not him dying. There he goes. Definitely worth using the uh, uh, Plague Pistol on him just because he also deals a full heart of damage when you take a shot from his darker than usual bullets. And I walked into the laser. Not looking too hot on health. We did stash half a heart in the uh, heart bank though, so that come to handy. This also does have, appears to have the chamber or the uh, door latch that leads to the uh, rat's chamber. Not gonna worry about it too much. We did unveil the uh, the drop as well. Completely with that. Don't even worry about it. Okay. Yep. There it is. We don't have. As I said, we didn't, we're not gonna pick up the uh, key for it. Brown chest. Perfect excuse to just blow this puppy up. We did get junk. We can offer to the junk statue, and I will use some plague piston ammo to check again for the secret room. I don't believe we found it uh, either. Yeah, I don't see it. All right, so we can offer to the shrine, uh, which is over there. I will try not to walk into a pit this time. That's uh, definitely. Oh, hello. We got a. What? Oh, never mind. Drinking something. All right, so we're gonna donate our junk to the altar. We got knight in shining armor. I actually don't know what what that was. I'm not sure what blessing that was, but uh, we got it. So we're gonna take it, and I hope it's positive. We got armor. I'll take the armor. Okay, these guys these guys are annoying. They're getting blade pistoled and I already lost the armor. Although, free hit, I guess, for the junk. I'll take it. Roll through the spider webs. They do slow us. They aren't just for decoration. Room cleared. I think that is also the floor clear, if I'm not mistaken. We do have enough casings now for the mustache. We will be buying the mustache. We will be looking extra fancy today. Not too many passives, and we're low on ammo for a lot of our guns here. Might... There isn't even an ammo drop I can pick up, so we're just going to get the mustache. Can I buy a blank? Can I buy a blank? Uh, there's a chance the blank, uh, the uh, secret room is also connected to the shop as well, and you can't shoot in the shop, so... That was the wrong button again. That's that's really not good, um, because I'm pretty sure that that gun is just going to be stolen now. Yeah, rip, 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 plague pistol. Wow. Feels bad. Uh, in that case, well, we're gonna use the we have the douser. Uh, douser is awful. We're just gonna use the frost giant here. Thankfully, I did before the ammo on this. It is the gun knot, or the um, it's a tank. I forgot the actual name of the enemy, but in either case, frost giant here, doing work. Again, all about getting him down. I will try to catch anything that would hit me with a blank. But I uh, can't guarantee that. Yeah, it's the Dreadnought. I'm just gonna pop Knife Shield. I'm not gonna launch it just because, again, I, I probably want the defense at this point. <laughs> we haven't been hit yet, which is good. I mean, it's good for several reasons, but again, we do want to get the health upgrade. Knife Shield's ready again. 
I'm just gonna pop it as well. Really helping out here. I will blank. I was forced to use the blank there. We're out of ammo on that. And I don't think the Dallas here. Yeah, actually, I'm just gonna switch over to the default pistol and take a damn hit. Unfortunate, we're out of blanks, so we're just gonna have to use the default pistol here. You can see the damage here is abysmal. But I will try. Make this rather a cash tag for the kids. He fell for it. We got a knife shield. Focus fire on the dread dreadnought. Okay, well, all of those knives just failed me. We took two hits in that, not bad. But again, we don't want to take anything, so we get the health upgrade we didn't. That is... The gun engine? The gun engine? Taking a swig. By the way, that's most likely going to end up being our... That's not a mimic. Room clear, or our... It's a robot's left hand! Okay, this is now... That is now our... Uh, Room clear. Well, it kind of has to be. I really don't want to use the marine pistol on uh, the rooms that we're going to be facing here, so. That is solid. I'd say. Gonna head back to the shop. Don't think I can afford anything. I definitely can't afford anything. Robot's left hand, though. Super useful. High damage. High fire rate. Hopefully, we'll get us through to fight the dragon. And if possible, we will kill the Marines Pass. I don't feel confident in this run going through bullet hell. Especially considering we just didn't get that many health upgrades in the past few, or the past two floors. We didn't get any health upgrades. Could have found a heart purse, heart, uh, heart bag, but we didn't. Unfortunately, also the chest quality has been a little bit lacking. Either way though, welcome to the hollow. I'll try and show you the floor, but no guarantees. I'm gonna use the douser on the zombies, not gonna worry about it too much. Oh, there's still one more. There's two more, actually. There's still more. This is why why the guns are dangerous, kids. Don't use them. Free blank. We have three blanks. Oh, I guess the uh the lodestone we got also gives us a free blank. I'll also take that one. Okay, I'm gonna stop using the water gun on the uh, actual enemies here, and I already lost my armor. I lost armor again. Because that screaming dude. I will have to kill him. He's not a hazard, he's an actual enemy. Uh, that is amazing. Please, please stop dropping my weapons. Okay, uh, we are gonna go for the shell here. I think I'm, I think I'm used to Breath of the Wild's controls. But here we go. Shotgun's back. Shotgun shell, more precisely, is back in action for the next like 26 shots with it. Just let these shotguns handle them for us. Enemy spawned in, so I'm assuming we got him. I rolled into him, and he didn't get punished for it. Got a key pickup as well. Nine more shots in our shotgun shell. Seven. More gun, more gun dead. Uh, almost got hit by that sniper. Not gonna worry about that. The Germany rifle's back. Need a reload. Scared me a little bit, and I did not dodge roll. Did not dodge roll in time to take down the, or to avoid the sniper kin shot. Again, the Gemini rifle is just a really solid room clear for us. At least when it has ammo, that's gonna blow up. We're just gonna take it. It's the potato flute, which is the ocarina. Foul play. I think if the chicken gets hit, it's like in ocarina of time or most Zelda games when you hit a cuckoo. Let's go this way. Okay. Well, this was a dead end. Really glad I went this way. They hit the they hit the they hit the chicken. 
They're, they're hitting my chicken. Chicken, attack them. Chicken. Chicken, please. Chicken. Oh, it's a jammed gun, Mancer. A gunjerer. Hit, hit the chicken. Hit, 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 my, hit my chicken. No, wait. Uh, what, what gun? Okay, this has ammo. I might actually have to check what the chicken flute does, because I don't remember, apparently. Because I imagine he does more than just stand there and take uh, shots for us. Let's find out. Ammonomicon. The sound from this strange instrument seems to have summoned a chicken. Okay, well, never mind. Look, I said the Ammonomicon could help. Alright, robot's right hand. Just, just tear through them. Just, just murder all of them. I'm trying not to hit the uh, Reaper, because the Reaper will only go away when the room is cleared, so it doesn't matter. He's alive or not, didn't get hit there. No, you may not summon the skeleton. Halloween's over! Okay. Another jammed enemy. I am tempted to drop the knife shield just because of how, free how unlucky we're getting with these, but... Alas. It's been it's been I think it's been more useful than hurting us. Um I'm just gonna refill the robots right left hand. It's been really good for us. This should be a zombie room, right? Yeah, it's just zombies. Okay, you're not a zombie. Oh, please don't summon up. I hope that's oh, I was not looking. I hope that's not what I think it is. Three, what? Okay, three and a half hearts remaining. Gonna refill her, her Germany rifle. Stick with the robot's left hand. Actually, no, I'd, I'd rather have the robot's left hand for bosses anyway. This this gun is just really good for room repair, as you can see. So is the AK-47 and the uh, AK-47. The vertebrae AK-47. You don't get to summon anything. I wish the cuckoo would do something. We have five blanks, I really should be using them, but I admittedly I haven't really found too good of an opportunity to take advantage. I did manage to free freeze that gun conjurer, uh, the gunjurer. Take him out. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it takes, it just takes a little bit, and then, and then the, the kaku gets mad. So he's gotta take uh, quite a bit of damage though, I wish he'd proc a little bit faster than that. Oh, you can see it. He's pretty pissed. Freeze that boy. You don't get to summon anything. He finished the summon. It's a jammed enemy. Another partial ammo refill. We'll definitely use again. Chest. It's a synergy chest, boys. And we got it. It's the, uh, the scrambler. This is actually another really solid gun killer. So we have the damage. The bullet or the egg. We have a synergy with it too. Oh, yeah, it was a synergy chest. Obviously, we're gonna have a synergy. Did we find the boss? Did we find the shop? Because I'd love to pick up some hearts. Uh, we did not, but that pathway should lead us to it. Uh, we'll be using the huge enemy rifle again for room clearing. Hopefully, the Kaku Kaku, you know, he's been. Oh no, we have a regular boss and the mini boss. Okay, uh, in that case, we'll be using robots left hand. Oh, I hate this one. Okay, I have five blanks though. And I'm going to do my best to remember that I have five blanks and use them. Uh oh, you don't want to hit my cuckoo. You don't want to hit this cuckoo. My cuckoo will mess you up. He's, he's pissing off the cuckoo. Cuckoo, get him! Just, just blank that. Come on, get pissed. Get mad. Alright, well, we got a heart, we got a Gemini credits, I'll try not to walk off the edge again. Uh, that could be a mimic, it doesn't look like it's moving. Knife shield check? No, okay, not a mimic. Is that just, it just gave me casings, what? Okay, shop? Not shop. Actually, if it was a shop, it would have told me it was a shop before I went into it. I did not see that bullet that was hitting me, because I was shooting other bullets. 
No, just just give me my my stunning pistol. That's a lot of zombies. Not gonna risk it. Just 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 shoot them. Here's finally the shop. He has the mime cutter and a gun muncher. Do I have guns that I want to feed to him? Okay, the mega the mega is definitely gonna go. Uh, and I guess the shell as well. Mine cutter is solid though. Yeah, take the mega dancer. I'm aware that we will get a, a gun between those qualities, but I'm hoping the high roll. Guardians, betrayer, excuse me, betrayer shield. Solid, solid. Could buy the full heart, might be useful. <coughs> excuse me. But, we have three blanks. The fourth floor bosses, I'm pretty comfortable with. We're gonna go with Robot's Left Hand and Scrambler for this boss fight. Let's go. It is the uh, wall monger or the wall bullets, the blah, 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 blah. Uh, I'm noticing it doesn't have a health bar. I feel like it should. I feel like it usually has a health bar. I'm just gonna blank. You can see the scrambler doing a ton of damage, and he's enraged the cuckoo. You've enraged the chicken, and I got hit. Feels bad. Feels bad. It was like seconds away too. If I if I got that dodge off, we would have had it. Unfortunate. The cuckoo did do substantial damage, and as you can see, the scrambler is really good for that as well. Is that is that the commando? That's not the commando. That is the the RBG. I don't know. Maybe the Gemini rifle. What needs ammo? Scrambler is definitely good. I think the... Yeah, I just fill up on the robots left hand. The RC rod. This is the one that I have to like, guide, right? And not the best. 83 shells, though. Or casings. Uh, we don't have any more blanks left, so I'm not going to find the secret room. Or we're not going to uh, go into... Reveal the secret room. Goodbye, we don't have enough of the ammo cutter. Or for the uh, mine cover. I will just get a key and a full heart to restore our health. The exact change for that as well. I think that's the floor, and it is. And we're going to be exploring the fifth chamber as well. With 10 minutes to spare. Should be able to do it. I'm not really keen on sticking around the fifth floor, especially since we're just going for the past kill as well. I will have to remember to get the bullet that kills the past, though. Uh, I'm prone to forget it when I'm going for pass kills because I usually just go for bullet hell. But we don't have time for an hour for an hour plus long dungeon run, so. I will also not be using the RC rockets. We're gonna stick with our left hand for room curve. Alright, and this is not the way to go. If you couldn't tell, Chance Jalan, you're gonna have to you're gonna have to bite it here. We also, okay, so now the drops are being very nice to us. Uh, I'm going to, uh, can I, I want to save the heart, please. I, I want to save, okay. Uh, I'm going to attribute this to our godly pickup of the mus mustache, giving us the extra coolness. There we go. That was a statue. We do have some uh, fallen uh, gungeoneers. That's okay. They will fall by our hands so shortly. Can these gun drawers, like, go away, please? Kaku! You've enraged the chickens! Okay. Let's see. There's a gun sprite coming at me. I see that. Does anything need ammo? Oh, this does. Alright, so, you know, we've gone from having no ammo on our guns to having all of the ammo for our guns. Very happy about that one. That is a jammed... That's not a chance, Jalan, thank god. But he's still jammed. And that's really annoying, and I took it, and I took a hit. Glad I bought the heart last time, and I wasn't paying attention, and got hit again. Slowly falling apart, but uh, I'm confident that we can still pull this one through. They've once again enraged the cuckoos. The chickens. The chickens are mad. Um, leave. Yeah, okay. I'm assuming he was just a late spawn of the room. Ammers! 
Stop hammer time! Can I just find the dragon chamber, please? No? Okay. Oh. I tried to ask nicely. And now I have to murder everything. Okay, there is a key over there. I'm looking forward to that. My chicken is uh, wily. But the room has completed and he's fine. We did find a chest. It's green. I will open it. It is the Beholster. Or Eye of the Beholster. It's the Beholster's gun. Okay, there was a heart in this room. I will pick that up. Thank you very much. Eye of the Beholster is a solid gun, but it is not... You don't want to drop it. It is not better than the robot's left hand. Here we go. This room's annoying. Almost took fire damage because I was looking over where I was shooting. I, I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna let these uh, bullets pass me. I see you, Gunjur. No, 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 no. Pop the knife shield here, pull over the bat of defense, kill this guy who's coming up next to me. Ooh, okay. I still have three blanks, though. Uh, it's, uh I, I should, should say I still have all of my blanks. I did, t I took, I got hit twice here. Again, slowly leeching health, that's usually what happens here. We're on the last four. No heart drops still. I'm gonna go on the right here because I think the left will just leave. Oh my god! I think the left here will just lead me to the. Uh, I'm gonna have to go to the left. Bug boots would be nice. Actually, what what the heck am I saying? Obviously, the health upgrade would be really nice. Monster blood. Those of you who read Goosebumps, monster blood. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I'm gonna go down here. Actually, I think this one leads to uh, to the uh, locked room, which is a chest. Okay. Trigger that guy. Um, it's a uh, Lone Star Gun Knight. Got hit by the platform, or the, by the block anyway. <sighs> yeah, actually, I actually want to go up. Well, unless this leads to the left, but I'm hinging on this one going. If this one goes up and to the left, then we definitely know that this one is for the chest. It, it's just a dead end. Okay. It is not a dead end. I misread the map. Again, that stuff on the ground is not for the background. It will light me on fire, which is why I am jumping over it. Key. A lot of keys. I mean, we've been finding solid chests again. We found it! Now, the question is... Well, I actually have to find the... If I go down the half a heart, hopefully I'll be able to show off the gungeon. Or the, the uh, dragon. But I do need... To, I still need to find the bullet that kills the past anyway. And we're out of ammo for that gun. And I dropped it again. So we're just going to use the eye of the Beholster here. They've enraged the Cuckoos. The Cuckoos have been enraged. Poor chicken. They knew him well. Hammer, I'm just going to blank. I was expecting a hit there and I was pretty sure I was. They have once again enraged my chicken. They need to stop doing that. Is this another dead end? Okay, there is, there is a gun juror. I will just take the enhancer out first. We should be fine though. I'm assuming something else spawns in this room. Yeah. I'm trying to remember not to reload the eye of the beholster because we do get that friendly eyeball. Getting health back slowly but surely. We are in better position to take down the dragon. I thought this was the goddamn. <laughs> I was really hopeful that this was the forger, the uh, the forge, but it wasn't. I mean, the floor is called the Forge. Uh, I was referring to the, the actual room itself. Why are there so many bullet cannons in this room? I understand the gimmick of the room, but come on. The holsters help me. No, this is for the chest. You gotta be kidding me. It's blue too. I'll take it. It's the sponge. I mean, it works. Okay, uh, the per- okay, the person's there. Let's go. Should be able to do this. Yep. That should be the room. Please, please don't summon the thing right next to me. I'd appreciate the action. Oh, no. Chickens! Kakus! I, I walked off. I walked off. Okay, okay. You know, bring it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. Pop knife shield. Uh, let's go ahead and get some ammo for our left hand. This is not the forge. This is not the forge. 
There's another Chancellor in the room. Oh, knife shield. No, I still got hit. We got the Cuckoos, though. Still Cuckoos coming. We got it. We did it. We made it. It's 32 for that. Stout bullets. We can get another blank as well. Oh, boy. Okay. Give me the bullet. We did it, boys. Okay. Now I just have to not die to the dragon. Easy. We should have the health to do it. We do have the Scrambler as well. We are in good straits to defeat the dragon here. He's enraged the cuckoos! Yo, those chickens do hella damage. Alright, that's good news for us. Scrambler, doing work. I didn't blank them! I messed up the timing royally and I've gotten hit. Scrambler, kill that man. Okay, the Kakus have once again been enraged. Dude, they're chunking them. Bleeding a little bit in the next segment now. Phase two. Easy, boys. Easy, boys. From the brink of destruction, we brought it back. He has once again enraged the chicken. Anyone who's played Legend of Zelda now knows not to make that mistake. The chickens will murder you. Oh, we have to go through one more phase, one more phase, one more phase. One more phase. He's gonna enrage the chickens again. This is, just, this is just too many bullets to not enrage my chicken. The Cuckoo Swarm, coming in. Win the W. You want you want the win, Cuckoos? You'll be. You, I I just killed the dragon with the chickens. Right on time too. Although I probably we should probably kill the pass since I was typing that up before. Where's where's my tizzy casing? There it is. We did the boys. We get to murder the pass. Let's go. This one. Andrew, Andrew, this one's for you, my boy. And I will not go to bullet hell. One more thing, we have to kill the past. Actually, yes, it's the gun that kills the past. That sounds cool. And after we kill the past, we will be transitioning the Overwatch. I have him going over. <laughs> wow. I was I was I wasn't expecting it to go this much over. So, Kevin, why don't you tell me what game this is parodying? Yeah, this game. It'll, it'll become obvious. It's doom.
I'm actually running out of ammo on my Germany rifle, which is a problem. I appreciate that the Marines in the background are actually shooting, by the way. That's 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 nice. Okay. Rough pattern, rough pattern. Rough, really rough pattern, actually. Please, please just die. Oh my god. Okay, well, I already killed his past anyway. I went over. It's not a huge deal. Didn't kill the past. Feels bad. That was for Andrew. Failure. Okay. Where we go going over to whatever the next segment? I think it should be Overwatch now. It is Overwatch, yes. And then they may bleed over in the Kevin's double segment because he has two segments. I'm sure he doesn't mind. We'll be right back. Exposition. Yeah, I like people to give you story at the beginning. Okay, talk. yeah, but it shouldn't be that long. <laughs> like, I'm on Destiny 2 right now, right? There's one of yeah. those. It's been like at least three or four minutes of just walking out slowly. I'm 